So with Violet, there just aren't enough adjectives to describe her. Um, she, she's engaging, she's personable, she's vivacious, um, she's caring, she's concerned, she's compassionate, but it's really her passion that just stood out the most when, when I was her editor and as I've known her through the community. I was Vi's editor for almost 30 years, and yet in all that time, I don't think I ever assigned Vi a story. That's because she always came to me with story ideas. Um, where other reporters would find dross or perhaps nothing at all, Violet found journalistic gold. There's lots of reporters, there are many people who can write stories, many people who can do research and come up with news stories, but she had the unique quality of mentioning the right names at the right time. In the course of her long and storied career with the Cleveland Jewish News, almost 50 years now, Vi has covered countless organizations, um, lunches, dinners, black tie events, and also the speeches that go along with the chicken salad and the, and the salmon, the, and the grilled salmon and the over-rich desserts. Yet, she, and she would complain often facetiously that she was getting fat because of all the meals. She never lost her enthusiasm or her freshness for these events. And, that enthusiasm and that freshness would come through in her writing. She's passionate about the community, um, certainly the Jewish community. She's uh, very passionate about the Jewish community and that showed through in the work she did at the Cleveland Jewish News. But she's passionate about the community in general and you know whether it's a health organization, arts and culture organizations, educational groups, she's out on the scene, she's at all their parties and their events and their galas. She's working the room like no one else. Um, you know, like a politician, she's, she's making sure she meets everyone in the room, and more important, she's making sure she gets a story from everyone she meets. She's the ultimate journalist. She, I call her the Iron Lady of Cleveland journalism, because that's what she is. She had uh, unlimited energy, unlimited uh, enthusiasm for her job, and that's what she did. Every week she went out, went to the parties, went to the events, went to the meetings, found the people and wrote about them. And that's why the column was so compelling. That's why it was so popular. Nobody has ever been as dedicated to a job as Violet Spivak. Violet's particular ability is being able to see and portray each and every person in the best possible light. That's journalism with a heart. And in that realm, no heart is bigger than Violet Spivax. Violet, you deserve the biggest mazel tov that I possibly could give you because, and a big hug and a kiss, because uh, you personify the highest standards of journalistic reporting. Congratulations, Violet. Um, this award means so much to you, but also to the community and the people you covered to be able to collectively recognize a job well done and a job that you're going to continue doing for a long time to come. Violet, I congratulate you. May you keep on going because you're one of a kind and um, you're a treasure. <laughs>